I would like to replace this outlet with this Decora temper resistant 15 amp outlet. So first, turn off the power and never work on live circuits. Also, before you pull out the outlet, make sure with power tester that it doesn't have a power even though you turned off the power. Uh, once you pull out the outlet, you can also double check. The easiest way to remove these wires, some people cut them off. If you want to do that, you can do that. But easy way is to push in with the um, some flathead screwdriver like this at the pen right here and it will easily come out just like this so, and then you can remove lastly your ground wire and there are times you will have an electrical box one pair of wire or two pairs of wire or maybe even four pairs of wire where it could be connected straight to the outlet two on side terminals and two backstab to the back so what you're gonna do in that case if you have anything more than just one pair I would suggest a pigtailing method which is connecting all the black wires together with the wire nuts and then just feeding the outlet so basically you should have only one wire one pair of wire going into the outlet so we're gonna install this Decora outlet, uh, pretty much all of these outlets have a backstabbing method as well, but I like to go by mounting it to the sides. So first of all, what we're gonna do is we are going to connect the ground wire. So connect the ground wire. And many times when you undo the wiring, pay attention if these wires are damaged here because we have to uh, make a loop here so we can connect it to the bolts on the side. Make sure that it's not about to break. If it's about to break, please strip new section of the wire and then connect it to the bolts. Once we connect the ground wire, neutral wire goes to these silver screws on the left side and the hot wire which is black wire goes to these brass screws on the right hand side so you're gonna connect these um, the loop going clockwise just like this I screw the bolts all the way in because in my case the electrical box is metal box and I don't want these uh, hot terminals to stick out um, and I like to screw them in even though I'm not going to be using those. So now let's connect the hot wire. And also when you are installing these outlets a lot of people prefer just to tape it around um, and then install it. If you do have a tape, you can definitely do so for extra protection, extra safety, I would say, but it's not required. And also when you push these wires into the box, make sure it goes in nicely. There's a way to put it, basically creates uh, this S-curve where when you push this outlet into the box, wires are there just nicely and tidy, okay? Once you are done, before you put the plates on, I would like to test it out by going and turning on the power and see if it's working properly and if it's wired correctly by plugging in this plug tester. As you can see, these two lights indicate that we have uh, wired this outlet correctly. Now we can put the plate back on.
And just like that, we have replaced our old outlet with this new Decora temper resistant Leviton outlet. I hope it helps. Thanks for watching.